Smarklish Gaming here bringing you a video on Fallout 76. It's been a long, long time, but I'm back. This is unlimited score. Very, very quickly, grow up the score the fastest way in the entire game, as well as level ups. It is ridiculous. All coming up right after this. Okay, so welcome back. So the first thing you want to do is put one of these down in your base. If you're not yet level 25, you can find them at any train station. Just jot, jot along to the train station and you'll see them just outside the doorways normally. Here we go. That's it. Uh, and then what you want to do is put most of your perks in intelligence. The perk cards that you're going to be using for this don't need that uh, I would put uh, inspiration on at level 3 this is going to be amazing 15% gain uh, when you're in a team the rest doesn't really matter on that one a max intelligence doesn't really matter what you put in here as long as you've got scrapper very very important as well and on luck curator if you've got a leader bobblehead if you haven't it's okay don't worry about it and super duper very very important what i did as well just to help out with uh, with weight because you're going to be having a lot of weight whether that is junk or weapons you're going to try to get as many of these like strong back as you can and the pack rat is very very useful uh, indeed so the next stage of what you're going to do now is you're going to go across and you're going to consume your leader bobblehead if you have one uh, you can consume a can meat stew which is perfect uh, obviously you can find the can meat stew at feed the people that gives you a little bit of a bonus as well which is amazing you're going to consume a guns of bullets five you're going to open up four lunch boxes will give you an extra hundred percent if you've got any food that gives you a, a bo bonus in intelligence that actually helps your xp which is marvelous exactly what you want what you would do as well is get yourself on a team make sure that's a public team as well uh, and if four people and that public team is casual, that gives you increased intelligence, which obviously helps you out. Make sure that you're well rested in a bed upstairs. And just, I'm not going to get in a team now because I don't want any player names to show up. But all you're going to do is you're going to come across here and you're going to craft. Let's go to the crafting menu. And all you're going to do is go down to throw weapons and you're going to either craft a meat cleaver. We've all got them from meat weeks. If you haven't got one for a meat week and you can't borrow one off a friend, not a problem. The tomahawk works just as well. They all cost steel and wood. So if you make them and courtesy of a slider now, you can go all the way up to 255 and then just make as many of those as you can. So I'm going to make a couple of these and it's going to go all the way up. And see on the left hand side the score challenge complete has popped up for me and it says that I'm over encumbered in the top left hand side over encumbered doesn't really matter all we want is if it says max weight limit reach with it, it will do shortly that's when we stop and the more of these you can make at once the better it will be if you can see the score down the bottom my level is going up really really quickly and that was another repeatable XP gain which is unbelievably fast and obviously you only need 100 on that, but your score will grow and pop another one. Look at that. I'm over encumbered, still not max, so I can keep going for a little bit. There we go. If you're on Fallout first and you make this base uh, just with one of the weapon things, all you need to do is make sure that you have one of the scrap boxes there. Max weight limit uh, reached. If not, just drop steel in a bag behind you. It's not a problem. Uh, steel and wood. And once that's done, super duper has kicked in and we can scrap it out and we can scrap 6,984 of these meat cleavers so once I scrap those it's going to give me over 50,000 steel which is incredible and you're literally going to rinse and repeat see the score is going to go up and up and up all the time so throwing weapons again meat cleaver use a slider go all the way across to the top once that's all the way across to the top like this you're going to see your level is going up dramatically and as I say the more the more that you make of these the better it will be ah, that score repeatable popping like there's no tomorrow isn't it which is exactly what we want you're gonna go up, up as fast as you can uh, quick disclaimer that all of these um, all of these glitches exploits will get you banned I've been banned you know, once or twice myself on this game uh, just by exploiting and uh, doing duplications, that sort of thing. See, max weight limit has reached, so what we're going to do is exit that now. When we exit that, we can literally go to scrap and scrap all, and it's amazing. So if we have a look at the junk that I'm holding now, oh, come off the machine, have a look at the junk. 
you're actually generating more steel and more wood than you're actually using up because of the perks that you've got. Look at that. That's amazing, isn't it? Just for that very, very quick run. I've gone up a level and I've gone up on the score quite a lot and that's still going to go up. Well, that's it from Smart Glitch Gaming on this one. We'll see you on the next one. GG.